Hey there, viewers! Fasting is all the rage these days. Every health freak you know has tried it at least once. Fasting is where you eat very little or nothing at all for a certain period of time. There are several different types of fasting recommended, each with their own benefits. Today, we're going to talk about eight of them. Can it maintain your blood sugar? Does fasting fight inflammation? What can it do for your blood pressure? Is it good or bad for your skin? We're talking all that and more. Number 1. Your skin will be doing so much better. Fasting detoxifies your body. You're not eating as many gross calories. As a result, you'll see a decrease in your cholesterol and triglyceride levels. This can really benefit people with inflammatory diseases like eczema. Going on a fast can also reduce your risk of skin cancer. More research has suggested that holding back on unhealthy food can stop the spread of cancer cells. This is good news for anyone with a history of this in their family. There's also a popular movement known as skin fasting, where instead of skipping out on food, people put a hold on harmful skincare products. The fewer chemicals on your skin, the better. This is done to reduce the amount of damage to your skin during cleansing. While there isn't really any scientific evidence to support the trend, it's become really popular among younger people. Give it a go! Have you struggled with acne in the past? What was your technique to get rid of it? Did it work? Sound off in the comments section and start a conversation with our bestie community. Number 2. Fasting Can Fight Inflammation I mentioned a second ago how fasting reduces your risk of eczema. Inflammation affects more than just the skin. It also plays a role in heart disease, cancer, and arthritis. Research has shown that intermittent fasting, eating within a certain period of the day, decreases inflammation significantly after one month. The same thing happened when people fasted for 12 hours a day over the course of a month. And get this, another really cool study showed that people who ate lower calories throughout their day had less of a chance of developing multiple sclerosis. This was because their levels of inflammation was reduced. If inflammatory disease runs in your family, you may want to look into fasting. It could really make a difference in your health. Number 3. Your blood sugar improves Fasting can help you control your blood sugar levels. This does wonders against diabetes. When your blood sugar levels are healthier, your body sees a reduction in insulin resistance. A study of 10 people with type 2 diabetes found that short-term intermittent fasting lowered their blood sugar. You can reduce your insulin resistance by just limiting your calorie intake. Not only is intermittent fasting an option, you can also do alternate day fasting. This is where you fast every other day and eat whatever you want during non-fasting days. When your body becomes more sensitive to insulin, you're better able to transport gluten from your bloodstream to your cells. The effects on insulin resistance are different for women than they are for men. One piece of research has shown that alternate day fasting might actually damage blood sugar control in women. The same thing has very little effect on men. Number 4. Fasting can boost your brain function I'm not sure about you, but if I can make my brain healthier, sign me up! Fasting can have lots of positive effects on your brain. Keep in mind that the studies done have been limited to animals so far. At the same time, they're still pretty convincing. A 2013 study on mice suggested that intermittent fasting not only improved brain function but your overall brain structure. This was shown after 11 months. Cutting back on harmful food particles encourages the production of cells. These nerve cells will increase your brain's ability to function. As a result, you'll think more clearly. Number 5. It can boost your life and slow down aging No, fasting does not hold magical powers that completely stop you from aging. At the same time, a good diet may add years onto your life. Again, I only have animal studies to reference. But hey, rats are living things too! A study showed rats that fasted every other day lived 83% longer than rats that didn't. I mean, that's pretty encouraging. There are other studies that support these findings. A good routine of fasting may very well be what your body needs to slow down the effects of aging. Let's be practical. Fasting can stop inflammation, right? This reduces your risk of disease, right? Well, less chance of disease means a greater chance at a longer life. It all makes sense. Before we continue, have you been on the wrong track with your diet lately? Check out our recent video discussing what happens to your body when you cut fruits and veggies. Now back to our list on the benefits of fasting. Number 6. Fasting Helps Chemotherapy Yep, we've hit a dark point on the list. Nobody wants to talk about cancer. But like I said before, fasting can reduce your chances of getting it. A study has suggested that fasting every other day can reduce the development of tumors. The lack of harmful particles in your body will stop the spreading of cancer cells. 
If you were to grow a tumor, it would not be as large. If this is true, then research indicates that fasting may have the same effect on tumors as chemotherapy. Fasting might even increase the power of chemotherapy drugs. This is really good news for anyone with a history of cancer in their family, especially if you're at risk of specific types. Changing your diet habits can really help reduce disease, but don't get your hopes up just yet. There's a lot more research that needs to be done before this is set in stone. Number seven, you can lose weight, a lot of weight. I mean, what would a list of fasting benefits be without weight loss? There's a reason so many people do it in the first place. If you're trying to shed a few pounds, fasting can do wonders. Let's talk about the human growth hormone for a moment, or HGH. This is a key hormone involved not only in growth, but also your metabolism, muscle, and weight. If you wanna lose weight, you have to make sure your HGH is in check. Research has found that fasting can increase your level of HGH. If you're up for it, fasting for an entire 24 hours can really cause it to spike. There have been studies done on adults to support this. Another study found that grown men who fasted for two full days saw five times the increase in HGH. If your blood sugar and insulin level is being maintained, this will help your HGH levels even more. Weight loss is a stressful process that can drive you nuts. If you've been trying time and time again to drop some, it's not enough to be watching the quality of your food. You also have to watch your quantity. If you're willing to go further than eating smaller portions, you might wanna consider fasting for a period of time. Number eight, fasting improves your blood pressure. Let's talk about your heart for a minute. Did you know that heart disease is considered the leading cause of death around the world? Over 30% of deaths worldwide are a result of heart disease. Pretty scary, right? Well, fasting can help with this. Studies have shown that eight weeks of alternate day fasting can reduce your level of bad cholesterol by 25%. It will also reduce your triglyceride level by 32%. This will give your heart a well-deserved break. Who wants to live life fearing that their heart may give out at any moment? Fasting is even more important if you're obese. A three-week examination of obese adults showed that their blood pressure went down after fasting. As a result, their trips to the doctor were reduced. If you want even more hope, fasting has been linked to a decrease in coronary artery disease. This is where you see a buildup of plaque in your arteries, which reduces blood flow. It's largely associated with heart disease and can lead to both heart attack and stroke. Your diet is so important. Whether you're fasting or simply eating healthier foods, you need to watch what you're putting into your body. Have I sparked your interest? Let's keep the conversation going. Check out our video on the military diet and how it helps you lose 10 pounds in three days. Or how about the 10 best foods to eat on a diet? Go ahead, click one, or better yet, watch both. Learn more about how to become a healthier person. Have you tried fasting? Did it work? Let us know in the comments below.